Hi, I'm Margo Mee, and I'm the Product Manager at Haas Corporation. Today we're going to teach you how to use an eye wash gauge to test an eye wash. ANSI standard says that you should use an official eye wash gauge, and that when you are testing the flows, the, the two points of water should reach these two spots here, no more than eight inches from the head. We're going to show you how that works. You activate your eye wash, and then the eye part, you go ahead and you put the eye wash gauge in. Now wherever these two points are meeting, you want to make sure that that is no more than 8 inches from the face of the unit. If it were way up here, that would be not in compliance because it would be over 8 inches, but it also gives you the opportunity where you could hurt someone because they have too much pressure going into their eyes. So you want it to be right in a good range. You also need to be careful though, making sure that the flow isn't too low because you want to be able to have your eyes in there and be able to flush them properly. The eye wash gauge on typical eye washes also is used to, um, to separate the water flow so that you make sure that your flows on either side are good. With the new Axian MSR, because we have the inverted flow, it's going to um, drench you from the inside out. You don't have to worry about that. You're not going to have any um, one side overpowering the other. So that's a great feature about the Axian unit. You just want to make sure, though, when you're testing, that the flow is proper. If you have any questions, you can go to www.hosco.com or call us at customer service. Thank you.